Hello everyone and welcome to the show and I hope you can never learn too much. I'm actually in a great here on my laptop here. Drinking one of these. And of course, yes, uh, it is the 4th of the 3rd, yeah, 2024. I'm just looking at my date on the calendar here. And it is Monday here. It's not bank holiday Monday, it's just normal Monday. And uh, of course, I thought I'd do a talk of the day here. And uh, I thought I'd have a chat with you guys here. Let me just reduce the picture here. Talking with us, talk of the day here. And uh, of course, yes, uh, wherever you are watching, we do appreciate it. Um, I thought I had. Oh. We've got a blank screen here. Uh, I don't know if you can still hear my voice here. Uh, let's move it to another camera here. That's better. It should go back to normal here. I've got two lots of cameras here, which that shouldn't happen. Um, let's get rid of one. Uh, we'll remove that because we don't really need that really. Just at this time. So yeah, I thought I'd be on a small, small screen in a bit there. But yeah, it's just because I'm sort of moving everything around on the um, integrated camera which of course is the built-in camera for the laptop that I'm using which is quite a good laptop actually I thought of course uh, which was a scare by the way I thought the scare was that uh, my laptop wasn't gonna ever work ever again but hopefully it does last a long time now that I know what to do and of course I can um, Make the, oh, make the screen go blank. I don't know how that happened there. So, yeah, it's just one of those things, isn't it? You just have to sort of uh, wonder sometimes. I thought it was a software issue, but when I took it to Nikon, which done a fantastic job just by pressing the button, and Thankfully, he didn't charge me for it, <laughs> just for pressing the button. You know how it is these days where most people just charge you for everything, which is absolutely going too much over the top. But I'm so pleased I've got this laptop working now, which is a great thing here. I've got myself a tea for £1.20 here in the regs here. And I just bumped into Stuart Mays, who, of course, um, was uh, in... The high street inside actually somewhere in one of the shops and of course uh, he introduced himself to me which is quite great and big thumbs up to you Stuart Mays who of course I've seen his name come up on Facebook I believe he subscribed to the YouTube channel as well but if he like anyone else wants to support the channel by purchasing one of our merchandise for a souvenir gift for yourself like a mug well not quite like this but even better than that you know a sort of mug that would be absolutely awesome to actually keep and uh, pour a bit of coffee in or tea or hot chocolate or caramel hot chocolate that kind of thing but yeah amazing isn't it but uh, yeah I'd like to uh, say a few Shout outs to everyone here, and hopefully I'll be back on tonight on Facebook. That'd be quite nice, but if I do it via the laptop, it will not work for whatever reason. I do not know. I'm going to do some editing today. It kind of like dating my trip that I was going to do going to Ferris and Evans today, as uh, Stuart was talking about my trips to Ferris and Evans, and uh, many of you might have seen the videos here. Please do look at the videos that uh, do come up on the channel. And I'd just like to say this now. There might be a video that might come up at the corner of the screen like that. Do watch it because it's definitely worth it. Click on that link and it will directly go to that video on YouTube. Now, hopefully there isn't any copyright issues with what we do. Of course, it doesn't concern us right now because we're not in the super chat mode at this date 
that I'm speaking on, which is Monday the 4th of uh, the 3rd, which is March 2024. So, of course, uh, it doesn't affect us right now, but of course, uh, it's still kind of like annoying to see our copyright tunes being tagged by YouTube. So, we've got to make sure that, of course, we submit the out of copyright tunes. Most people um, back away from the dispute because you can't dispute the copyright. If it's out of copyright, it's out of copyright, okay? Anyone can make it and make your own arrangement. It's the arrangement that is copyrighted. That I do know. As we know, the music industry itself is very complex. If you don't know what complex means, it means complicated. And uh, yeah, it's just one of those things, isn't it? So it's talk of the day today. Um, I'm not going to stay on for too much longer because I don't want to bore you lot to death here. I'm so thankful for my laptop, <laughs> which is the make of Leveno, by the way. I thought it was a Dell one, but actually it's not. It's just as good. It cost a small fortune to buy, but we probably need another one for the nice and relaxing show. But if you want to support us by getting a laptop for Julian to be able to perform for you, then feel free to help support us in any way you can. We've got GoFundMe, which is on our community section and our Facebook pages and even Twitter as well. And possibly TikTok as well. We don't use TikTok very often, but we sometimes post videos like this on TikTok. But anyway, I'm going to leave that reason for in mind. Thank you very much for watching, and we'll see you next time. Peace out. Can you hear what's playing in the background? We might get demonetized for that. It's probably Ed Sheeran or something. See ya.